I, I think it's really important, especially in young women, girls and young adults to, but everybody to get tested in iron. A lot of symptoms of iron deficiency can mimic psychiatric conditions. So it can cause irritability, depressed mood, fatigue, low energy, trouble sleeping at night, restless legs. So definitely want to get that tested. That does require the blood test because iron supplements have their own risks that can cause constipation. So you want to take the appropriate dose. So that's something to go to the primary care doctor for or your psychiatrist. You can't just do a CBC, which is a typical lab that pediatricians will order to test your hemoglobin. That might not be enough information. You want to do the full iron panel. In low iron, one of the things that can cause is anemia that might show up on the, you know, the CBC, the blood count. Um, and if you're anemic, we need to get to that first. Part of being a psychiatrist is that we look holistically at also the medical health, your physical health. If someone is anemic and they're complaining about fatigue, restless leg, depressed mood, the first thing you got to rule out is any sort of like vitamin deficiency. So it's so important that you have these routine lab tests. And again, CBC is not always enough. Sometimes you need an iron panel to make sure that, hey, maybe we just have to correct some sort of like metabolic hormonal um, vitamin deficiency before we jump to prescribing antidepressants. 